What's up everyone, Takedown here. Welcome back to another hockey card video. Today I have purchased a few different hockey card types from different dollar stores. So today is a dollar store hockey card video. I'm really excited for this. For this here, first I went into Dollarama and I picked out two of their pristine marketing packs that are 15 cards per pack. I think these are a dollar or a dollar fifty each in Dollarama. And then I went into the dollar store that is literally right next to Dollarama, a just a small little local dollar store, and these 10 hockey cards were $1.25, and I honestly never opened these before, i never seen them before, so we're going to be opening up both of them and see which is better, the local dollar store's repacks or Dollarama's repacks. Let's just get into this. I'm going to start off with the uh, local dollar store packs. They are a cheaper quality package to begin with. So I don't know, but since it's only $25 price difference between these packs and these packs, not too bad, at least in my opinion. Let's check it out here. First pack, Dustin Takarsi. Uh, they're all backwards, so we're going to flip it here. Uh, Patrick Marleau, I do PC. I don't know if I have that one. Uh, Rafi Torres, Hudler, Seaman, McDonald's. They're all the same uh, of the same year. Tobias Emstrom. Uh, let's see here. 2013-14 Upper Deck Series 1, which I was not collecting that year, and I don't have any cards from that year. So that's cool. We have Kopitar. I like that card. That card looks cool. Victor Hedman. And Dion Phaneuf. So, I mean, that is cool. I wasn't collecting that year, so that, to me, gets some bonus points. We got a Patrick Marlowe here, which... Let me see if I can grab it here. Um, I might have that one already in my collection. I don't 100% know. So that's not too bad. Let's do the other local dollar store pack. And see what we may find in this one. So up first we have James Ramir. And they're all backwards again. So let's go this way. Mike, Mike Riley. Johnny Goodrow. Which that card looks awesome. I do not have that one. I do PC him. So that's cool. Uh, Dehan. Uh, Konski, Corey Perry, Palmarelli. Ooh, that's cool. Uh, Washington, Joe Geno. Um, it's kind of like a blue foil card. I'm not sure what this is. Pacific looks like, yeah. Um, 1997, that's why. So that card does look really cool. Uh, Halmarsen. Oh, I thought they were stuck there. And yeah, so that's really cool in my opinion. For being a dollar twenty-five, very interesting cards, but is it worth more than the uh, fifteen card packs from Dollar Rama? Let's open this one up here and see. Whenever I pick these repacks from Dollar Rama or Dollar Store, I always try to get the front player and the back player players that I PC. So up first we have Jason Zucker, Jason Zucker. Sorry, that's how I always pronounce it. Flip it here, Mark Fitzpatrick, which I might already have. But I'm not 100% sure. Uh, Longero. Probably butchered that. Brian Bellows. Oh, every which way these ones. Gilbert Brule. Uh, we have a... I can't see his name. Still can't see his name. It's not even on the back here. Um, I, sorry, I can't see his name there. Too much of a glare. Uh, Pavel Brendel. Uh, Bronco... Horvath. I thought it was stuck here, but it's just a thick card. Uh, Tom Fitzgerald. Patrick Waugh. I don't know 100% if I have this card. So I'm going to put it there. Rob Gubitero. Uh Yashin. That's cool. I do PC Yashin. Gray Roberts. Jeremy Rodnick. And Frederick Olsen. So we did get two great players that I do. Or sorry, three. Uh, Rodnick. Yashin and Patrick Waugh. The Patrick Waugh card, I'm feeling like I already have it in my collection. Uh, there's only one way to find out, go through my collection, which I don't have time to do that tonight. Next pack here from Dollarama, we have Sean Coutier. Uh, Darren Pupa. I'll, I always get this one. This is probably the 10th one I got out of Dollarama packs. Terrible. Uh, Jeff Smith. Tom Curvez. Ooh, that's cool. One of the ice clearers. Um, and it's all in French. So it, it does look cool, but I have no idea what it says on the back. Mites Commodore. 
Yep. Uh, we have Ila Kovalchuk. P.K. Subban, which I don't think I have that one, so I'm going to put that there. Oilers, Mark Lamb. Chris Nyland. Uh, Frederick Olsen again. Different card, though. Uh, Kiel Samuelson. Mark Osborne. And we have Brent Connolly. So that was really, really cool. And getting a chance to compare Dollarama packs versus my local dollar stores packs, which literally there's a dollar store that's been here about 20 years, a local one. And then Dollarama opened right next door to it, which is taking away all of his business. But comparing these two, these ones here were cheaper, but lesser quality. I did get some cards that I didn't collect that year for, for 13, 14, which was really cool. However, I got more cards that I PC out of these ones. I got PK Saban, Yash, and Patrick Waugh. That Patrick Waugh card, I think I already have it. And I think I've got it out of a uh, Dollarama pack before as well. But still really cool. So in my opinion, which one is better? I honestly love Dollarama. But I'm always going to support my local dollar store. And try to get my stuff there first. So this one here to me is a draw. Because both Dollarama and the local dollar store. I love buying both of them. Comment down below which one you thought was better. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Please take care. Peace.